Hello boys and girls, today it's the Belgian Trail Championships in La Roche, a little town in the Ardennes. It's a 42 km race with 1500 meters of elevation gain to conquer. For me it's a training run, I'm not gonna go full gas because I only started training a few weeks ago. So I'm just gonna enjoy a full day out in nature here in Belgium. <laughs> kilometers far in the race 32 minutes and we're heading on the, the second steep climb it's a very technical terrain I like it almost eight kilometers in the race very beautiful trek alongside the Ourthe, one of the, one of the nice rivers in the Belgian Ardennes. Uh, I'm going very slow, but I'm enjoying this day in nature. Uh, this is what trail running is about for me, clearing my head after a period of uh, not feeling very well. But uh, we were only an hour in the race, and I'm feeling better already, so uh, thumbs up. All right, 10 kilometers far in the race. Uh, I took a bit of a wrong turn because I followed some other runners, so I did one kilometer extra, but now we're back on the good track. It was very technical. I couldn't film because I needed my both hands on the slippery rocks, but now the terrain gets better. And we're heading towards the third climb. Uh, I'm getting uh, my rhythm back. Uh, very nice scenery. What a beautiful sunny day in the Belgian Ardennes. It's almost 20 degrees and the weather predictions give 25 degrees today so I'm drinking a lot uh, very nice I think the most technical part is over now uh, almost 15 kilometers I'm doing great but the legs already hurt <laughs> I thought the technical part was done but uh, then the rocks of Le Hou came and I made a pretty nasty fall. My arm is bleeding a little bit. Uh, I'm doing it very slowly now. Now it's a steep downhill, but good runnable track. Uh, we've passed uh, the 20 kilometer mark now. So uh, almost halfway. Very nice weather, a very nice track now for the downhill, so I'm enjoying again this trail. It's a beautiful trail, very technical, but uh, yeah, I must do. and we are approaching the aid station just in time because all my water bottles are empty I took some time in the aid station to refill my bottles 
I, uh, I have now one liter and a half with me for the next 15 kilometers. I, I guess that will be enough. But it's very hot and I got a little bit dehydrated in the last section. So uh, I took some time to drink lots of isotonic drink. And now it's less technical. So uh, let's go for a run. Almost kilometer 30 in the race. to go and then downhill to the finish 35 kilometers now the legs hurt but my head is fresh so uh, looking forward to get a beer later on some Belgian fries as recovery food uh, this Belgian championship was a very hard race and, uh, I'm glad I did it only five kilometers to the finish it's the last climb I'm gonna do it slowly because my uh, legs are hurting uh, after this climb it's just downhill to the finish uh, I think I'm gonna eat another ultra gel with caffeine now just to get my finish right uh, <laughs> Last summit of the race, now downhill to the finish. Yes, oh, what a race! Oh. So beautiful. Yes, sub six hours. <laughs> All right, the race is over. I'm glad I could finish it sub six hours, but uh, there is lots of work to do for my next race in six weeks, the GTLC in the high fence in Belgium. It's a race of 85 kilometers. Uh, so yeah, lots of training to do. And then after that race, I can start building up towards the UTMB. Uh, my legs are completely kaput, so I'm now gonna take a rest at home. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up or subscribe uh, on my channel with one of the buttons down below. And maybe see you next time. Bye!